The future of humanity in space will be determined by the answer to a single question. What will happen first? The first human born in space or the first combat fatality in space? We do really important work, and that work is in uh, three main focuses, defense, space solutions, and, and of course, Starlab. The way I would frame Voyager, the companies in aerospace and defense that have the most capability have no ambition to do great projects. And the companies that have the ambition to do great projects don't have the capability. And I thought to myself, could we create a company that's assembling enough capability that you could build the replacement to the International Space Station, which we have the privilege of working on that project called Starlab. Projects like that go to the moon, you know, build infrastructure that allows people to live and work in space, uh, but do that in a fun, entrepreneurial, creative way. Someone who runs uh, Inspired Capital, we get to look at big, inspired ideas all day long. Space is just getting more interesting. What are your predictions? If you can make the global economy 5% more efficient, that's three and a half trillion dollars of value. Think of space as the massive, massive data play and more satellites were launched in the last 12 months yep. than the entire history of the world. We have reliable, inexpensive launch to orbit. That completely changes the game. Think of space as the eighth continent.